What is going on, YouTube? This is Sam from Team Sam X1 here. And Ryan, bro, what did you do this weekend? I got top 64 with uh, Lost World Dinosaurs. Shut up. I swear to God. No, you're, you're lying. We got the mat to prove it right there. Yo, yo, you're doing it all for that. Like, you're doing this for all the that dino fans out all there, the man. Dino fans. For why, sure. why did you decide to play this deck? Uh, actually, I've been playing this deck for about 14, 15 months now. Um, I've done really well with it. I got 16th in the LA Regional. Earlier this season, I got back to back second place finishes out in um, the Midwest. West. I've been playing it, it's been doing well, so I just thought I'd take the nets. And uh, what's so good about dinos? They just OTK, man. That's they it. Just, that's they the pump so much damage on board, this is insane. So that's all you do? You summon UTT and you, and you win? Yes, uh, the UTC and then there's uh, Lagia. I can make Lagia really easy and that's a solemn judgment on legs. Uh, really good. It looks, uh, it's a going second deck. So even though I won almost all my die rolls, I always choose to go second. So even if I lose the die, die roll, I have the advantage. Always going second. Okay, awesome. And uh, without further ado, man, anything else you want to say before we get started with this video? Uh, I had a pretty good time. I wish I could make a lore uh, further, but not too bad. What did you finish in day one, the record? Uh, nine wins, one loss, one draw. That that's your total record. Uh, yep, and then I lost round one of top 64. Oh, that's it's, it's, it's all good, man. It happens. It happens. 60, top 64 is amazing for like you know a 1,800 player event. And enough talking, I am mind blown right now. All right, all right, Ryan, let's we'll, get it. We'll get into it. Uh, you round three, Ash. Yep. Uh, the best hand trap, uh, three draw. And uh, these these are mandatory, right? Like you. Like oh, you these are mandatory. Yep. If you want to do good, and then going second is fantastic. It stops your opponent, and it just it lets you break their weak board. Uh, I took out the ogres, put in the veilers. How come? Uh, ogres not very good with Goki and things being able to uh, chain block you. Uh, this gets around it. You can um, still hit their link monster as chain link one. Mm -hmm. It just stops the place. It's great. Awesome. Um, I'd like to run a small uh, kaiju package because since you are going second, you get to. Uh, I kaiju away any problem you have. Anything, mm -hmm. any, any problem, just get rid of it with the kaiju. Doggeron's also searchable off of uh, <clears throat> your main monster. Awesome, so let's awesome. search 20 second package. You have how many cards? Three, 11 already. Yep. Cards going second. Uh, yep, so then um, are you run the two babies. Uh, how good are the babies for you? <clears throat> babies are really good. You only run two of them and no petite. You do not want to see this in your hand at all. Uh, any more than this, it's going to be clogged. It's gonna be bricky. Awesome. Great. Oh, too bad. Um, you're gonna run two giant rexes. Two giant rex. A lot of people play one giant rex. How come you play two? Okay, so the reason why is uh, you see leather. I play. I play two gold suck, Right. It's a. It's a. It's a free special. You can get off um, into a rank four play, and sometimes. You just have to banish, if, if you banish it once, it's only a once return special summon, but sometimes you have to banish it twice a turn just to get out of that conductor, and you don't want to lose that forever. Because mm. that, that's a recurring piece that just helps uh, make XZs and press for game. All right, awesome. And it's 2,000 beat sticks, so it beats over any trick stars. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's great. And then uh, when, it's summon, when it's special summon from the banish zone, it gains 200 attack for every banished dino. I've had this up to like 3,600. 3,600. Just, just poking. You're him, him, him and conductor just poking. You're crazy. Bro. It's crazy. You're crazy, man. Obviously, right. the uh, best, best card, best card of the deck, and then what well, I wish Konami'd bring back to three, <clears throat> miscellaneous. How broken is he? Please. It's so great. Uh, how good? It's um, it's Play. it's unfathomable. Um, so you pitch it from hand, <clears throat> and it becomes a it just it's a blanket protection from anything. So like, uh, you so you can chain block with your Lost World in this with your Over Raptor, and let's so you make um this chain link two, your Lost World chain link one, and then. They have the ash chain like three, then you make this chain like four. So then everything resolves. You get your search and the token. You can pitch this secondary effect, and you start plus. Start going crazy. It's insane. It's insane. Um, the one qualus. Only one. Only one. How come? If I could play this card at zero, I would. <laughs> it is. If you see this in the hand, it's it's awful. It's, it's the only card in the entire deck you do not want to see. In your hand. Yeah. Otherwise, uh, really good to send off of Over Raptor. Really good to send from Lost. Fantastic. Okay. You get the double Evo pill. Card's busted. Um, I have a question. How uh, Did you ever resolve its, its, its secondary effect? Oh, yeah. Um, uh, at, yeah, the secondary effect is fantastic. You banish it and uh, <clears throat> normally three others from Grave. Mm -hmm. Special summon an Over Raptor from your deck. And then you, you banish the uh, Giant Rex off of it, too, so you get that free special. So that's, a, that, that's an instant rank four right there. This got called by the Grave a lot. People did not want me to have this card. 
and uh, unfortunately it is at one and uh, this will recycle it if you can get this into your hand first but normally you never have to recycle in this deck. Um, I think out of the 11 rounds, I think five or six were two O's. Two O's. Two O's. Seriously. Just, just bodying people. <laughs> and speaking of bodying. Bodying, show, show him, the, the, the man oh, himself. The big boy. <laughs> How good, how good. Fantastic, oh my God. Yo, he's the best boss monster of all time. Best boss, uh, he is. He is, literally. He's a book of moon. He, eclipse. Book of Eclipse. Book of Eclipse, the whole field. Attack every monster directly. <clears throat> Excuse me. Attack every monster on the field. A thousand. And if they're in defense, flick the thousand. It doesn't destroy. It, it sends. sends. Oh, it, it sends. sends. We said it together. We rip. know. Cosmo. Rip. Rip. And then, uh, you know, with the new time procedure, you know, with the... Uh, oh, yeah. So, uh, people, you know, if they don't have anything, they'll set some cards, won't take damage. Well, you just get them on the field. You're still doing a thousand. You can swing with your other monsters for more damage. It's insane. Wow. Um, yeah, I'll... I'll, I'll get into the, more of it later. All right. All right, so for the spells, I run the one Slumber. Slumber. They're on Foolish. This is really good. I used to run Triple Gold Sark, but that's bad. You run the one Foolish because you can send the Quatlas, get the effect. Mm -hmm. Or if you're missing any <clears throat> any dinosaur to um, banish four off miscellaneous, mm -hmm. you can put your Giant Rex in there to banish it, to get it back. And Foolish can send any card, so you can even send a non-dino for your pill. That's nice. really good. The one Dark Hole, uh, I don't run Rageki because Rageki doesn't pop my own babies. Mm, so he's, yep. <clears throat> um, this is a really good OTK where you have a Lost World, you normal summon baby, give him a token, Dark Hole. You send another baby to protect the token, and all of a sudden you have two babies in grave, chain like one, two. You just get lots of advantage. Like I said, double Gold Sark. Uh, this is for the Rexes. If you unfortunately have all the Rexes out of play, Put down a Nash, put down a Conductor, just really whatever you want in two turns, which this deck can definitely survive. You're gonna back to your hand and probably win that win that uh, game. Double Evo Pill. Only two. Only two. Um, because you don't want to see this without having any of these in grave. Yeah, 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 hand traps, right. Any of the, any of the non dinosaurs, yep. Um, back row, the only thing that beats this deck is back row. So twin twisters. Double twin twisters in the main, really good. Uh, the double terraformings. Yep. And then we do play the triple Lost World No Diagram. How, how, how good is this card for you? It's fantastic. Um, when they control the token, it prevents uh, targeting of any monster field, mine, mine and theirs. All nine Donnas lose 500 attack and defense. That is huge when you pair it with Conductor. Mm. So not only are their Trick Stars already really weak, they're down 500 more, and you just keep just swinging. Sweet. Just oh, it's it's a massacre. It's a massacre. It's a massacre. <laughs> it's a massacre. <laughs> and then uh, Triple Rota. The best card, obviously. So best good. card. It's, it's, a, it's great. Essentially, you're playing six o, o Raptors. Six o Raptors. It's fantastic. Six o Raptors. Six Tyrannos. Six everything. Everything. It's All right. fantastic. So that's pretty, pretty much your main deck. Do you have anything else you want to change in the main? Uh, in the main, um, no. I think I think the main is it's Perfect. solid. Solid. Perfect. All right. Awesome. Let's go off to your side deck. All right. Uh, the side deck, I did enjoy. I did enjoy the side deck. I don't think I'd change too much about it. I wish. I don't know. You always think maybe there could be more, but I played the third Valor. <clears throat> it's an alt, unfortunately, but <laughs> we'll make do. Ghost spell. Uh, before this tournament, my buddy told me pick up some ghost spells are fantastic. This yeah, guy right here. Yeah. And I'm like, ghost spells are trash. Other oh, trash. But this card is really good. <laughs> Everyone on their moms are playing Call by the Graves. And it stops that. Um, and it stops the Trickstar Reincarnation in Grave. And it stops uh, the Goki rematches. Um, I play some True Dracos. It stops, I think, their heritage from shuffling back and drawing. Mm. It's just, it's a great card. Uh, Called by the Grave at three. I lost my supers. I don't know where those are at. <laughs> These disgusting ones. But uh, yeah, <clears throat> Called by the Grave, really good. Uh, obviously, it's self explanatory, it hits everything. Now, this is a little interesting. I, I played the three DD Crow. DD Crow, how come? Uh, <clears throat> So, if I played any uh, invoked players, you can hit the invocation. If I played the ABC players, you hit their pieces. I actually sided like maybe two of these against uh, Pure Striker because when they Wait. go they go into their Kagari and they're like, oh yeah, I want to gauge for the seventh time today. You go no, and you just just, just get it out of there. Peace. See ya. See ya. Um, the three MST. MST. What? How come? In the gates. In the gates. <laughs> no, no. Uh, the MST though, it's, it's really cool. Um, 
like I said before, back row, I just auto lose. So uh, Ultra Geist, True Draco, anything with back row. Uh, I actually beat a True Draco player. He flipped anti spell. I uh, MST'd it. He flipped um, Skill Drain. I had two MSTs in it. I MST'd that too, and then I attacked for uh, about 9,000 damage after that. Crazy. So, and the last but not least, the Hatred in. No evil lease. Uh, I can't run evenly. This oh yeah, this because oh because, because yeah, of the battle the phase. phase. So uh, unfortunately, spear mode and evenly does not work with this deck because all of your advantage comes from your normal summon and all of it comes from your battle phase. So that's that's kind of a downside of this deck, but uh, it wasn't obviously too detrimental. Yes. The hey Trunade, interesting choice. Uh, do not run this against um, most back row decks because most traps are reactive; they're just chain. This is against pure strike striker because all their decks must be chained to uh, an effect you're doing. And the best part about this is when they use their multi roll and they set four from their grave, they banish everything. They banish everything. And then, of course, you gotta rep the, the dino sleeves for the, for the tokens. Nice, nice. All right, let's go up to your uh, uh, what's it called? Sorry, extra deck. Extra, extra deck. deck. All right, so um, I, run the, uh, I run the lightning, and of course, you gotta run the uh, this counterpart. I run the Castell. How often do you go into him? I didn't make lightning um, at all. But the thing with lightning is, it's lightning, and you have to, and you, you have to run it. Uh, Just in case, you know. There were times where I might have, I should have gone into it, looking back. But um, the whole 5,000 attack, no effects till the end, like end of um, damage. It's it's just it's too good. You have to run it. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> I cowboyed for game, I think, three times. Cowboy for game, like in time or actually game game? Game game. A oh, game game. Opponents like main phase two is like end phase. I'm like, no, 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 no. We gotta go into the XD here. <laughs> it's like, what? A like, cowboy for game. Fantastic. It's crazy. Crazy. Uh, the real MVP, though. Double log, yeah. Double log, yeah. You gotta run it. It's a solemn judgment on, on legs. On legs. And it's fantastic. Um, this card's actually really fun. People people look at me funny. This is a Dryden that lets you draw. For uh, Lost World. For Lost World, because Lost World loads them by 500, so they're always at, at non original attacks, and it is, it's really good. Um, Diamond Dyer is fantastic. So let's say they have one back row or something, or one problem monster, and then you know you need to get over it to OTK. You uh, target, target, pop, and now you have a non dino engrave for your double evolution pill. Really good. Tornado Dragon, deal with that back row. Dolko for monster effects. The Dweller is just too good against uh, like uh, True Draco, you know. It's just not bad. Uh, Babuska, if they make me go first, I rely on the hand traps of Babuska. Uh, underclock enables so many OTKs. And then I do main deck the Mermaid, uh, just in case they leave, leave me with the Ibley. Yeah, it's hard. It's tough. It's tough. It's, it's a tough matchup, and you'd like to get out of it some way. Um, I never. I only played one Goki the entire event. You're lucky. I'm a lucky man. You're lucky. But um, finally, this dude, I resolved him once or twice. Resolved him tw uh, two duels. Two duels, and, and it was game. It was game. <laughs> so um, it's actually it's uh, the uh, true Drake. Both true Drake players I played uh, cleared their back row, got a double conductor. One normally, one with pill. Uh, attack, attack for seven thousand. Overlaying the rail cannon, burn for two. Awesome, bro. It's dirty. Awesome. Awesome, man. Congratulations on top uh, 64 with dinos, bro. Dinos. Dinos, man. Uh, for anyone who's wondering my uh, what my matches are. Yeah, yeah. what's your matchups? Uh, my first four rounds were pure Sky Striker. And you crushed all of them. I crushed all of them. My fifth round was uh, Trickstar Sky Striker. I ended up losing to him, uh, but he was number one uh, day one and two. Really? So he's so undefeated. Undefeated. So my only loss on um, regular play was to the undefeated guy. After that, I played True Draco. You crushed him too? And uh, my round seven, so this is actually kind of a sad story. Uh, my opponent didn't show up for round seven. Oh. He did. He showed up, sat down, took out his math, took out his calculator. Someone stole his deck box. Oh. He came to the event, sat down, couldn't find his deck box, ran. I, I, I felt bad. I felt awful. I mean, it's it's round seven. It's late in the day. No one wants to win that way. Um, I hope he ended up finding it eventually. But uh, after that, I played another um, true Draco, actually. And you crushed him. In round eight. Uh, the same guy who uh, built, the same guy who played true Draco earlier, built that dude's true Draco deck. <laughs> so it was actually really cool. Um, then I played Trickstar Sky Striker, beat them as well. 
And then um, today, round the round one of day two, I was on the feature match against Gokies. Had some had some bad misplays, and we end up drawing. Oh man! It was it was pretty tough. And then um, I played Trickstar Sky Striker, beat them. Uh, game three, I ended up OTKing on my first turn for game three. And then I made I didn't make top 64 cut, but I lost to Tris, Trickstar Sky Striker on the uh, the featured match. Oh no no problem, bro. It doesn't matter. It's top 64, bro. Congratulations, man. You yo you did well. You did Thank so you. well. You did so well, man. Congratulations, man. And yeah, like you said, this deck uh, UCT. It's a massacre, bro. It's a massacre. It's, 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 okay, all right, man. This is Sam from Team Sam Sam Sanyao. Shout out to you, bro. And all right, peace. Ooh, I feel like Usain in the cheetah print. Talk fresh game, I don't need a minute. R.I.P. the game, shh, I need a minute. Okay, let's proceed with it. I'm in the house, got the deep with it. These bozos always sneak this and they take a shots. I'm a keen with it. Like, no, no, this league business. Ooh, you